Have you ever seen coral have sex? Now you have. We came out with the Coral Restoration Foundation to what scientists have dubbed Spawning Alley. Once a year after a full moon when the perfect day, tide, and sea temperature align. Staghorn and Elkhorn coral release bundles of egg and sperm. And they call this coral spawning. What we look for when we get down there is something called setting, which is when these gametes, these bundles of eggs and sperm, are being held in the polyp's mouth. And the polyp is just one animal of many on a coral colony. And if it's setting, then it means that the coral is going to spawn. We're gonna start seeing tiny, tiny little dots being released. Fertilizing in the wild is a long shot to begin with, with a high risk of drifting apart or being eaten. So the scientists step in to assist to improve the odds. This is the first year since the 2023 record bleaching caused by warming water that Coral Restoration's nursery recovered enough to have a successful spawn. The gametes were taken to Shedd Aquarium's research vessel to fertilize safely in containers on the boat. We consider some spawning that we see to be successful. It means our corals are healthy. It means they're thriving. It means that they have the energy to reproduce. Find the full story on MiamiHerald.com.